Today we will be cooking an orange flan, a very nice, elegant, refreshing dessert with of course lots of oranges. And we will be using a cotler, an egg cotler, to prepare the flan. Um, this is the standard size, which is perfect for our purposes, but if you think about cooking breakfast, you would need a bigger one, the so-called king size egg cotler. And then you would add one or two eggs, some, some black pepper, some parsley, bacon, cheese, and you would cook yourself a wonderful warm breakfast. Um, but we're not here to talk about how to cook an egg, we want to make an orange flan. So let's start cooking. You will need lots of oranges, uh, both for the juice and for the zest, so preferably you buy some organic oranges. You will need some sugar, two eggs, crème to give additional flavour to the gel, and some agar agar. We begin by adding the sugar to the orange juice. Um, it depends on the sweetness of your oranges if you need more or less sugar, so simply taste your orange juice. Um, then the eggs, the key element in this flan um, to be combined with a spoon. It may take some time the mixing, but it pays off because you don't have any bubbles or air later on in your flan. Add the sweetened orange juice and again stir with your spoon until one smooth mixture. Well, smooth is important, so pass it through a sieve and make sure you get all the leftovers of the oranges or the egg or maybe uh, the odd bit of sugar. We are ready and we now have the liquid which we can add to our cutlers. They need to be buttered slightly on the inside and you fill them for let's say three quarter. Aubert Marie in the oven with hot water again for three quarter under the top of the cutler. To check um, Remove them from the warm water, take a sharp object, uh, in this case a pin, and then it should come out completely dry, exactly like this. We're now ready to make the sauce, which contains more orange juice and the Grand Marnier. Take your time, some 10-15 minutes to reduce by half, and then you have the basis of your uh, gel. The gel actually will be formed and created by the agar agar, which is a wonderful way of creating a gel without adding or removing or reducing the taste. It's, it's, it's a really uh, clever way of uh, working. Uh, no gelatine, but agar agar. Uh, you clean the, the lids, there will be some water on them, and then you start adding some zest, very fine, thin zest. A small spoon per um, flan will do the trick. Um, then we start using the warm uh, liquid, which will set quite quickly, um, so don't wait too long. And then add it on top of the flan and transfer the flans with a closed lid, of course, to the refrigerator for using later on. We all want to surprise our guests, so please serve the cutler with the lid on top and then, well, then you'll see the happy faces of your guests. Please enjoy the flan with a glass of Rive Salt André, a really great, powerful combination. For this recipe and many more, please visit our website www.cookanddrink.org.